BozemanSports.com. This is Sunday Night Sports. Welcome back. The Bozeman Bucks have a chance to do something no Montana American Legion team has done since 1962. Make it to the American Legion World Series. But right now they're playing the waiting game to determine who they'll face in the championship. MTN Sports' Sam Hoyle is in Lewiston, Idaho at the Northwest Regional. Welcome back to Lewiston, Idaho, home of the American Legion Northwest Regional. As most of you know, the Bozeman Bucks already have a spot in the championship game, and the field crew behind me is setting the table for Kennewick, Washington, and Idaho Falls. The winner of that game will take on Bozeman in the championship game, which you might think adds a little bit of a wrinkle to the Bucks game plan, but according to players and coaches, they don't really care who they face. Yeah, we don't change a lot team to team. Obviously, you have some tendencies you pick up on what teams do. And obviously, Idaho Falls is really aggressive on the base paths and, um, you know, likes to bunt and do some of those things. But Kennewick's, you know, kind of similar where uh, we're not we're not going to change um, much about what we do. We're just going to go out and play our game. It doesn't really matter who the opponent is. Um, I just know that great teams, um, good teams can win when everything's going good. And great teams are going to win. Um, when their backs are up against the wall. So we're going to come with everything we got tomorrow and we're going to leave it on the field. Well, the game between Kennewick and Idaho Falls wrapped up just a little bit ago with Idaho Falls picking up the win. So it will be a rematch of yesterday's game. Bozeman and Idaho Falls in the championship game and for a berth to the American Legion World Series in Shelby, North Carolina. We'll have your highlights back here tonight at 10. In Lewiston, Sam Hoyle, MTN Sports. First pitch between Bozeman and Idaho Falls was just a little bit ago, and like Sam said, we'll have highlights back here tonight at 10 and on MontanaSports.com.